Well, an environmental hazard is unfolding on York Peninsula where seven sperm whales have died on the beach. An eighth whale has just been spotted offshore. Authorities yet to confirm if it too has died. The extraordinary stranding has attracted locals and scientists, but there are now feared sharks will also be lured by the rotting carcasses. An incredibly rare sight. This is probably once in a lifetime thing that you'll see. It's really once in the last lifetime of the state, as far as we know. Not one, but six sperm whales beached four kilometres south of Ardrossan. A seventh later found in the shallows. The first mass beaching for this deep water species ever in the state's history. This is the first time we've seen live ones because they were alive before they came up on the beach and died. And it's certainly the first mass stranding of sperm whales for South Australia um, for in all our records, which go back to 100 years or so. The pod became beached during high tide at about 6.30 this morning. When they were found by locals at 8, just one was still alive. But it too soon died, leaving many locals distraught. And I feel real emotional about it. So really shocked that they're already dead. It's the saddest thing I've ever seen in my life. It's really distressing. One of them gets, is in trouble and so goes into shallow water so it can rest on the bottom and breathe more easily. Then when the tide goes out it starts calling and all the others come to help and they get stuck too. Were they disturbed? Was one of them ill? Um, who knows? Post-mortem examinations will shed some light but it won't be easy. Each whale weighs up to 50 tonnes. The council um, would have to bury each of those whales somewhere where it won't decompose and um, contaminate the beach. Moving them is a logistic nightmare. And Alice Monfries is live in Ardrossan. Alice, when can we expect some answers? Well, Kate, the autopsies won't be carried out until at least Wednesday and they will take at least a couple of days. Now, that means the whales will be here on the beach for quite some time and that has sparked fears that they'll begin to attract sharks once they start decomposing. Now, there's also fears that it is quite possible they can actually explode if the carcasses begin to bloat. So that, too, will be another reason why it will be very likely that from tomorrow the beach will be closed. Now, there are reports that the eighth whale spotted recently Recently, off the coast just a little bit south from here may actually in fact still be alive. So that will be the first priority for marine experts. Let's keep our fingers crossed for some good news. In